My name is Melanie Egan. I'm head of the craft department at Harbourfront Centre. Well, I think that the, the craft department at Harbourfront Centre is all about possibility and all about opportunity. Harbourfront Centre is very committed to supporting emerging talent in all areas. We actually subsidize the artists to be in our studio. When artists come here, we want them to aspire to the experience at Harbourfront Centre as being sort of one of the defining moments in their career. It's a highly catalytic kind of environment where you're working as an artist, pursuing your own goals in a public venue where the public can kind of see the behind the scenes of what goes on. So you're not working in a vacuum. You understand that you are part of a much bigger artistic community. I would describe my work as being drawings made out of thread. I sew into a fabric that dissolves in water and I build up the thread until it's able to hold itself together and then I dissolve the base. My process is very intensive and it takes me a lot, a lot of time to create the work. I'm usually working over surfaces for hours and hours. I've been working a lot with the figure and uh, hands um, and relating the delicacy of thread and its kind of ephemeral qualities to the delicate nature of the body. I came to Harbor Fund Center because uh, it was a perfect place to experiment and develop the kind of work I was thinking about. Also, because of the different mediums with the other artists, I've started to incorporate other things other than ceramics into the work. art that has like a story that goes along with it. So if you can look at something and kind of get a story and think that it's kind of clever, um, I like that and playing with words. I really like that Harborfront Center had a whole bunch of different kind of artists all working together. Um, because I have a background in different media, not just metal and jewelry, I like that there was all different types of people, people working with fabric and clay and glass and metal all working together. You know, you can get ideas from all different people, not just one thing. What appealed to me about the Harborfront Center is that it really represents just a huge opportunity to take risks and sort of pursue a creative vision that I may not have otherwise been able to do. A lot of times there's people who make component-based work with sort of interchangeable parts where one piece can break, you can just replace it with another. So me, it started with making one piece that all its components could only equal that one piece. So because it balances that if you're to break the counterbalance, you break the whole piece, whereas I can't replace any part of it. So it makes more, to me, more of a unified object. For me, to really achieve something that I can't achieve in real life. I think to balance one piece is, is uh, sort of something I strive for. You can't go wrong with collaborations with other artists and to interact and get ideas. So it's a really good network of different artists and a good support system. The great thing about Harborfront Centre is that it's not just about the craft corridor, but also about a greater community here. I mean, everyone here is really talented, so it's almost impossible not to grow. It's an unparalleled experience being here. 